Alright guys, good morning. Once again, this is a Filipina Blue family and good morning to all of you guys. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, um, I guess we need to answer some of those questions that are about how to find a good Filipino and basically a gold digger, guys. Yeah. So, and of course some other things in this video. So, I'll start because this is really how we tell when you guys are no good <laughs> anyway guys no seriously um, it's real simple um, especially now the ones this guys this isn't for the ones that are already married and um, this is for the ones that um, that uh, basically are trying to find a good Filipino woman um, and maybe some stories that we know of that are actually here in the Philippines once you do I'll just call him a bad Filipina, you know, but um, starting off with an LDR um, Really you should take your time in the sense of how long you you've talked to her um, As in other words, just an example me and her um, we've talked um, for a few months quite a few months Before I even thought about sending her money and she never really even asked for it. I could tell one time um, something about your phone Mm -hmm. Something about yeah. something up with the phone. I can't really remember. I think it was bad video or something or it was, she said it was cracked or something I can't really remember guys, but um, And I was well, you know, it's No big deal to send her, you know, a few bucks here and there to uh, get her a decent phone oh, Did you remember that is still? Yeah, I remember that. I remember that. I didn't eat for two weeks after that no, Yeah <laughs> <laughs> But uh, anyway, so um, but that's really how you should look at it um you know you go on those sites and um you're going to get bombarded by a bunch of um, filipinos um and you and really it's really easy to spot them right off the bat um I, you remember the one i told you about I, there was this one time guys um when i first got on it um I was talking to this one girl and all of a sudden she lost her purse and it was like the second day and she asked me to send her some money so she can get some new IDs. I can't remember exactly what it was. I said, sure, let me go to Western Union. And I just made up some bullshit number and sent it to her. But a um, couple hours later, she texted me back. That wasn't funny. But anyway, it was to me. Um, so really just um, take your time. Um, you know, she even when um, I was in the States talking to her, she never asked me um, to send money to her parents and actually the only time we ever i ever did that um was when i first got here because we were going there so we sent money there for um because they wanted a big party or something so you're just gonna know you know it's common sense guys so yeah. you know no matter how oh she's so beautiful you know and um you know oh she's so cool just take your time so that's really the easiest way to spot a go digger and then you can get there then you meet her um, and then you'll also know so just take your time so but for us I guess, I guess we're kind of fortunate do we fight a lot oh my god yeah <laughs> <laughs> we fight oh we, yes guys we fight a lot so much uh, arguing but uh, it's mostly because you're a nagger yeah I'm nagger I accept that you know how it really is? Uh-huh. Oh, she's a nagger. <laughs> but nah, she's a good wife, guys. She, we're just teasing. We argue just like anybody else, but it's nothing it's normal. major. It's normal. Um, when it comes in a uh, relationship, guys, uh, we, there's a minor uh, problem that uh, you guys uh, that having some uh, misunderstanding like that and it's kind of uh, just a little bit uh, argue but uh mostly i guess if anything the reason we're wanting to bring that it's not so much a culture difference it's um a conversation you think you're having with her versus what she thinks you're having so um then it's kind of like what you know and so then it, but like i said small issues guys you just gotta gotta learn how to 
to talk, but your English is getting better, I have to say. Really? Yeah, is my English Tagalog getting better? <laughs> Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Because you know, I, I am I am at work still every day, at night especially. Mm -hmm. You don't have a uh, any anyone to mess with me. <laughs> yeah, make you in bed. <laughs> yeah. Seriously, how's no, your how's your uh, live? Uh, my seriously, yeah. okay. Um, I, I hear a lot of people say it takes adjustments. Um, it, it really, I just it was just so natural just to um, just to come here and and live. But um, I don't know if it was because I've been here before, or um, you know, is there still some things different here than home? Yeah, but you know, you, it's that's where you're at that point to where you just got to decide where you're going to be. You know, home. You know, I was brought up to where home is where you lay your head, you know, so you make the best of it wherever you're at. So um, I yeah. guess in that sense, I've always had that attitude. So are there challenges? No, not really. You know, because every time, guys, I was uh, I was in at work almost every day and then he's uh, always uh, working, he, here. working here in uh, at home together with kids nowadays and they are only having some good times together while I'm at work. So still, even if even I'm, I am a security guy, but uh, I know my, I know my obligation is still when it comes uh when I'm reaching home from work. So I will divide it, divide, 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 fifty, fifty, fifty. So, which you know, which is good. It's good. Yeah. You know, it's just still. Uh, we are not losing our uh, healthy relationship. It's still. Oh, yeah. Even uh, there's a lot of uh, arguments uh, lately, but it's not a uh, it's not a very serious uh, matter, and besides that, is a, a part of uh, being a husband and wife. Yeah, but overall, we're having fun. Yes, we're having fun. So, but um. Other than that, to touch on, you know, the the living here, um, you know, I'd still rather be here than I would in America. So, what so. about the cost lately? Ah, yeah, and it, and it's fixing to rainy seasons already, guys. Here in Philippines, so we're planning and uh, we're planning a uh, best future for the kids because they are already fixing to uh, stay here with us and start, school start here. schooling here in by next uh, next month it's already uh, mid of May today uh, this time so we're preparing guys to uh, buy a little bit uh, things that they need to get, to school. get some school and yeah well, seven ninety one as we yeah. did this video, so almost eight hundred. Eight hundred. So Good we're expecting you. again, guys, to get some uh, more two hundred plus subscriber, so that uh, we have already uh, in one case pretty soon. Yeah. So if you want, guys, our still uh, endorsing the mugs, our teacher uh, t shirt, still just uh, go to our channel still and. Uh, the site it's the, the site. website the links in the description yeah the link in the description and click and see what it goes yeah um so yeah it's not just uh, mugs with her and stuff it's um, some yes. pictures of the the lake and i'm still adding some stuff to it so but anyway it's all for her <laughs> love you <laughs> all right guys thank you so much to for watching Thank you so much to all those subscribers that we have still and skip uh keep tune take care and god bless guys this is a filipina blue family thank you so much and god bless bye bye cheers